you will need a Prince August silicon rubber kit as well as a roller, a knife and also a container, a half a milk carton. We also provide a toolkit and you'll need some paper rolls for tidying up. We warm the plaster scene in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes, 50 degrees. We then take strips of the plaster scene to create a base so that we can embed the masters. We put on our underlay board and we lay down the master figure and also then we're going to have to put an in gate that we used from a previous casting. Embed it deep into the mold so that it has a 90 degree angle all around. Use additional plaster scene to fill in any gaps, including joining and bridging the master and the in gate. Then cut away the excess plaster scene you don't need, leaving about 20 millimeters all around. Then you need to round off the edges by cutting the edges off and giving a quick smooth. Then you're going to be building the walls for plaster scene, making sure that there's no gaps. Then use a biro to create indentations about three to four millimeters deep all around. Then put Vaseline in to help separate the molds. Then you need to measure the mold to get the volume of the silicon rubber. Work it out to be about 100 grams. You need a little extra because it won't be, you won't be able to get it all out of the tub. Pour the silicon rubber in, mix it up for about two minutes per 100 grams. Let it settle to get air bubbles out. Pour the rubber at one end and let it fill the, the mold slowly and top it up. After it has settled overnight, Remove the plaster scene all the way around carefully, then pry open the mould and you can see the master can then be switched over to the new mould so it can create the second half. Remember to trim off any excess around the edges, any lip. Make a bridge using more plaster scene. Then apply another wall using the same principles as the first time. Apply a Vaseline, a thick layer all over it. Then pour your second layer on to create the second half of your mould carefully. After another day, you can peel off the plaster scene and you expose your new mould. Remove the masters and you've got your new mould. Now we need to clean up that mould by removing any excess rubber. And also on the base to clean it up so you get a nice flat base. Then we can start testing putting the release powder on, giving it a clamp and support boards. Then we bring over the hot metal and pour it in all the way up to the top. Give it a chance to set in five minutes and you've got your first casting. Now let's compare. Yes, a success. Great.